More than 200 airmen are on their way to Afghanistan as the 188th Fighter Wing prepares for its first combat mission with a new aircraft, the A-10 Warthogs. The two-month deployment is shorter than most, but still tough on both soldiers and their families. 5 News reporter Russell Jones has more on how they cope during deployment. Families got up before dawn to wish their loved ones in the 188th Fighter Wing well as more than 200 airmen deployed to Afghanistan. And to help pass the time until they get back, some are turning to unusual methods. We're on a weight loss program. <laughs> 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 but we're, we're trying to keep up with him because we figure he'll be a little small when he comes back. Yeah, we've made little things at home, a little countdown calendar, and we have the little daddy dolls for both of them. She knows I'm going on a trip. She, you know, she knows a long trip. During this combat deployment, the first for the 188th in four years, families will be able to keep in touch with their deployed airmen through the internet and with the help of the National Guard base in Fort Smith. Some members of the 188th who've been on combat deployments before also have their own ways to make the mission fly by. A lot of it is you've got to scan up a schedule, you've got to set up a routine. Usually uh, you're going to be working and then uh, you'll either go to the gym or you'll go to the rec tent and then you'll go to basically to bed and you'll just do it over and over again. The fighter wing's been working through delays before this deployment. Wing cracks on the A-10s force them to replace and refit the aircraft's wings. But the group's commander says ever since they were told about the mission, they have been working steadily to reach this day. Of course, nobody likes to leave mom and the kids for any period of time, let alone 60 to 70 days. But everybody stepped up to the task, they got their focus, and when they stepped on the airplane, they had their game face on and they were ready. The more than 200 airmen that deployed today will join more than 75 airmen who are already in place preparing for the mission in Afghanistan. In Fort Smith, I'm Russell Jones for 5 News. The 188th is also working alongside another A-10 squadron out of Baltimore, which is providing about a dozen other planes as part of their mission.